News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow Industrials finish up 131. You had NASDAQ up 82. S&P's up 17. You had the NASDAQ, NDX 100, as well as the S&P, folks, uh, trade to new all-time highs today. We are going to get the Google numbers out. They're going to be coming out any minute. If they do come out in the next uh, 60 seconds, I will have those for you. Gold. Gold contract down $10.20, trading at 1495 With the Edward Gold, bottom line, you're backing down. Tremendously lighter volume. Gold had higher prices on Friday with volume. Gold still wants higher price. Silver, same setup in silver. Silver was down eight cents today, seventeen dollars eighty-four cents. Also had volume on Friday. Couldn't hold price back down today with lighter volume. Light sweet crude down eighty-eight cents, trading fifty-five dollars seventy-eight cents a barrel. That is on its way back down to the fifty-dollar level. We've been in this consolidation between fifty and sixty dollars for quite some time now. Notes and bonds. These are going to be the wild ones, folks. You had the ten-year note down ten ticks, trading one twenty-nine oh six. The 30-year off 29 at 158.15. Now, both of those had anemic volume coming on the way down. They're going after their September 16th swing low. And what that is specifically is that was the high end rates for a, a bit of 1.9. We're at 1.84 right now on the 10-year. Uh, it was the low on price. It's coming into that area with tremendously lighter volume. Now, they didn't hold price today. That's saying that we're going to be back down there tomorrow. We're going to charge after that swing low, and we'll see at that particular point, are we going to hold price? Uh, Wednesday at 2 o'clock, that's when you're going to have the Fed statement. At 2.30, you're going to have the news conference. The expectation is that they're going to cut back one quarter point. We're going to be we're at 1.75 to 2 right now. That's going to bring us from 1.5 to 1.7. I suspect the market is going to be looking at, in saying, flat out, the S&P is at all-time highs. We're cutting rates. What is that all about, number one? And then, of course, what are you going to do for me next? When is the rate, next rate cut going to be? And or is that the end of the rate cycle for this particular time? King dollar. King dollar down 107 ticks, trading 97,723. That is building cause, folks, to get down to the 95 area. Uh, last week, uh, you had a sideways move, slightly higher. Prior week, you came down with conviction. What is conviction? You had wide price spread all the way down. That is saying the dollar wants to go after this 95 area. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. And we look forward to speaking to you right back here tomorrow morning, 9 o'clock.